electrode things that are all over his body, giving him signals from the hands and so on. And he has a panel in front of him with buttons and dials and things. And so he more or less controls the body. But he isn't the same as the body because I am in charge of what are called the voluntary actions. And what are called involuntary actions of the body, they happen to me. I am pushed around by them, but to some extent also I can push my body around. This, I have concluded, is the ordinary, average conception of what is oneself. And look at the way children, influenced by our cultural environment, ask questions. Mummy, who would I have been if my father had been someone else? You see, the child gets the idea from our culture that the father and mother gave him a body into which he was popped at some moment, whether it was conception or whether it was parturition is a little bit vague. But there is, in our whole way of thinking, the idea that we are a soul, a spiritual essence of some kind, imprisoned inside a body. And that we look out upon a world that is foreign to us. In the words of the poet...